man who was kicked out of a bar, pulled out a gun, and shot the security guard point blank. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Russ Spence. I'm Christine Spiro and for Courtney Bryant, miraculously, that security guard survived and tonight his wife is speaking only with Fox 5. Rob Darienzo is live outside the Earl on Flat Shoals with more. Rob? Hey there, guys. Good evening to you both. Well, cops say that guard was just doing his job the other night outside the Earl. The bullet was just inches away from forever altering his life. He's okay. He was shot in the lower abdomen. Matt Pruitt's wife says he loves his job working the door at the Earl on Flat Shoals Avenue. On Wednesday night, he had to kick out a group of guys who weren't following the rules. Cops say one of those guys pulled out a handgun on Matt. The bullet didn't puncture any of his internal organs. It hit his hip and fractured his pelvis. Brandy Pruitt told me over the phone from his bedside at Grady that her husband has a long road to recovery. The shock of it has worn off, and, and he's now he's just humbling himself. Everybody's saying, you know, you took a bullet for these people, and you're this and that, and a hero. He's like, I was just doing my job. Cops say the group of guys the shooter was in jumped in what looked like a rideshare and rode off into the dark. Now investigators are trying to track them down. Meanwhile, the neighborhood has wrapped its arms around Matt. The East Atlanta Village community and all of his friends and people that we've known all along the way have um, been very gracious and donated and sent gift cards. Management closed the bar on Thursday, writing on Facebook, quote, we're stunned and saddened by what happened. On Friday night, they reopened. Brandy says that place is like their second home, and Matt's worked there for more than eight years. Don't stop going to the Earl. It's an amazing place, and, um, you know, what happened, they didn't deserve that. And, guys, Brandy tells me that Matt's prognosis is really good. He was actually up and walking around the hospital room earlier today. Meanwhile, he just wants to get back outside that door here at the Earl as soon as he can. That's the latest from here live in East Atlanta. Rob DiRienzo, Fox 5 News.